Evidently updating the firmware on the DEW is not as straightforward as just uploading. So this will be a supplemental video for the getting started video. Uh, first you go to the support documents. And here there is a video, the Arduino DEW Erase Microcontroller. So you open that and you get to here. Basically I'll be duplicating what's in this video but louder so you can hear what's actually being said. So we go back to our support documents. We go down to firmware and we download the top one. This is the date here of the release and the top one is the current one. If you need the latest update for the MDAX software it's the top one also and if you go down below is the links to the third party software that we would used in the other video. We know we have old firmware on this due, so we'll have to erase it and reset it ready to accept the new firmware. First we plug into the native USB port. In device manager we see our communication device ASF example COM port 26. Now we press the reset button and press the erase button release the reset button and release the erase button our driver now disappears we unplug from the native USB port and plug it back in last time we did this we got an MDAC driver here now we have a BOSA programmer port if you go to the top of the support documents open the help guide scroll down and we had mapmate last time but now we've got BOSA programming port now we go to our firmware download we find the firmware with the date that matches the one we just downloaded extract it using the MDAC lowercase password and it expands out to this we then start the BOSSA software. We'll match our COM port 25, but now we'll browse to our new firmware. We'll select that, open, erase all, boot to flash, and then we'll press right. So that's OK. Now we'll unplug our native port and plug it back in. And we have our communication device driver on COM26. Now install our new MDAC software. So we go back to our file. We'll now extract our MDAC software using the lowercase MDAC password. We get to our setup and we'll run the setup. This is what I mean when I say some antivirus don't like this software. It wouldn't install due to the antivirus, so I'll reboot later. MDAC lowercase and now it's working the antivirus closes it down until it clears it See what I mean about the antivirus? That's the MDAC MapMate software working. Just reorganize all the boxes like I had in the last one. So they're cascading and you can see them. That's the usual click on individual things in the table to get the boxes.